Potato is generally the second most important uh, food crop in Kenya after maize. And uh, therefore a lot of efforts uh, is required to ensure that farmers do not get losses but rather get profits. Uh, before Nikutane na George, viazi nilikuwa na rima lakini haikuwa inafanya vizuri. Time yenye tulipatana na George, uh, kuna ugojwa moja ilikuwa imetusumbua sana yenye haikuwa na ndawa. George akaja akakuja na ndawa tukapada na yeye tukaweka dawa na masao inaonekana hii iko juu kuliko that time This is a very good example of bacterial wilt disease as you can be able to see uh, the wilting the plant wilts during flowering caused by a pathogen called Rastonia salmonacerum Now this is a phytopathogen it gets it generally stays in the soil and uh, during flowering it generally uh, uh, prevents um, water from moving up the plant and that leads to the wilting and um, in this farm we use the product uh, we use the product where during planting uh, as you can be able to see the crops are doing much much better than what the, what they used to be uh, previously and this is a good example of uh, how the product is uh, functioning so this is seven grams seven grams of uh, the thymol encapsulated in chitos and nanoparticles so you put 250 mils here and then you put in the product you mix the product inside here so once you've already mixed the product inside so that gives you a stock uh, concentration uh, you measure 45 mils of uh, the concentrated solution 45 mils so this 45 mils is what you add into uh, 10 liters of water so you add into 10 liters of water uh, and then you mix so you drench the soil just uh, just as you move and uh, as you can be able to see uh, the results are quite uh, nice this is one thing that he has never gotten uh, since he started farming this place uh, in fact he had uh, abandoned the farm because of uh, the bacterial wilt so far only few farmers have been able to access this because of uh, the trial stage that we are currently uh, doing uh, going into the future if we'll be able to get support if we'll be able to get investors that can be able to believe in uh, the innovation that you have come up with uh, we believe that we can be able to produce a lot of it and uh, we, it can be able to support as many farmers as possible